All right, y'all, welcome back. It's your boy, Jahan John Snow, and I'm back with some more boxing. I want to welcome all the viewers to the channel. Please subscribe. If you're not subscribed yet, tap that subscribe button for me. Turn that notification bell on for the next video. Okay, y'all, now check it out. Thought I'd give y'all this quick news and update here. Now, haven't I been telling y'all on this channel that Terrence Crawford, being the undisputed champion at 147, He's automatically tied to the titles at 154, you know, and we already know he's undisputed at 147. So he's tied to those titles. He's carrying three titles still at 147. And I've been telling y'all him being tied to these titles at 147 and 154. I was saying that Al Heyman, because, you know, Al Heyman, it's looking like he got more control over the titles because those titles was Jamel Charlo titles. You know, I was telling y'all that he probably would have him in the PBC, Al Heyman in the PBC, would probably have to work with Terrence Crawford somewhat and probably have to find him a fight, you know. And it's looking like that's exactly what's going on. Because now, because now, right, you got the WBO, okay? This is what the WBO do. First of all, I want to say this. It's looking like that's exactly what's going on. Al Heyman is working with Terrence Crawford because now he's working with the dude Turkey over in Saudi Arabia that's putting it, putting together, that's putting together Terrence Crawford and Madrimar, right? Al Heyman is working with him. And his fighters is under his fighters is going to be fighting on the on this undercard. Big undercard, y'all. And it, this this card alone is huge and is and is great. It's going to be great and good for boxing. So you got Al Heyman now working with the Turkey guy. Um, the WBO, right? The WBO, this is what they did. They put the interim title up for the Terrence Crawford versus Madrimore fight. So this fight is going to be for two titles. It's going to be for the interim title and the WBA super title because the super champion is Madrimore. So they put this interim title up, right? Whoever win this fight is going to be automatically Sebastian Fundora mandatory, you know. If Sebastian Fundora choose to fight rematch Timzu, you know, the winner would get the winner of Terrence Crawford versus Madrimal. Or if Sebastian Fundora fight Earl Spence, the winner of Sebastian Fundora and Earl, Earl Spence, will be, will have to, you know, basically um, fight the mandatory, the WBO mandatory, which is going to be the winner of Terrence Crawford or Madrimal. You know, I wouldn't say they would have to fight each other. Let me correct. You know what I'm trying to say? They'll just be automatically the mandatory, you know, and most likely they'll be up next. You know, we could probably, you know, it, like I said, don't matter how we looking at this thing, y'all, it's looking like they want Earl Spence with um a title. They want Earl Spence with a title to get him in the mix of that um, 154, you know, division. And it's looking like that. Terrence Crawford and Earl Spence is probably going to bump heads, you know, and have a rematch. They're going to bump into each other again and have a rematch at 154, y'all, if these guys can keep winning at 154. And if Earl Spence can get over his opponent, whoever they match him up with, you know, if it's a Sebastian Fundora, you know, or a Timzu, we just got to figure, we just got to wait and see how this thing on the roll. Maybe, you know, they're going to put Earl in with, you know, they talking about Earl don't like no tune-ups. Yeah, he need a tune-up. He need a tune-up. 
Because if he don't get a tune-up, I can see Sebastian and Tim Zhu, you know, doing them this, you know, doing them dirty, doing them the same way during their, or even worse, like Terrence Crawford did them, you know. But we'll see, we'll see, y'all. But let's get back to this. Let's get back to this. Al Heyman is working with the guy Turkey. I told y'all that. He was um he's gonna have to somewhat probably work with Terrence Crawford because he's tied to those titles, you know, and um you got Al Heyman now, right? Like I said, he's putting his his fighters on his undercard. He's putting his fighters on his on his undercard. Because him and the guy is working together. And guess who's on the undercard, y'all? Guess who's on the undercard, y'all? Because I'm about to check out. You know, I don't want to make this video this long. We got Jarrell Big Baby Miller versus Andy Ruiz on this undercard, y'all. Also, we're going to have Vela Suedo versus Isaac Pitbull Cruz on this undercard, y'all. This is August. Now, they was talking about Pitbull Cruz fighting, you know, Barroso, Barroso, right? And, um, you know, we're hearing talks of, you know, Ryan Garcia. Um, people want to see him fight. People want to see him fight Subiel Matias, you know, and also Venezuela, right? He was supposed to have been fighting on the... Tank Davis undercard. So I wonder if he, he's still going to fight on the Tank Davis Frank Martin undercard, right? He is supposed to have been fighting Dela Santos on the undercard. So is he going to fight, you know, in June, right? And if he get past Dela Santos, will the winner face Pitbull Cruz? Are they going to do it like that? Or is Vela, or is Venezuela, Jose Venezuela is going um straight into the fight, you know, He's going to wait till August and going straight into the fight with Pitbull Cruz, you know, but they saying this is Pitbull Cruz first title, first title defense. So I'm just reporting what I'm seeing y'all and who's going to be on the undercard. And also who's going to be on the undercard y'all is Leo Santa Cruz versus Arda Marez. That's going to be the third fight, I believe. Um, the trilogy, they're going to be on the undercard and they're going to be opening up you know the open act of this car y'all you know what i'm saying leo santa cruz are Ar the my rest so just wanted to give y'all this quick news and update y'all huge news going on huge boxing gonna be going on in um in august man and this 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 is an ink so this 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 probably a is most likely official, you know, now, now the undercard could change a little bit, but right now, this is what we're looking at. It's an ink. Al Heyman is working with the, the um, guy in Saudi Arabia, Turkey, the prince, you know, which was a smart move to keep the, um, to stay in business. And like I, and like I told y'all, remember I was telling y'all, he don't make no money off um, Terrence Crawford versus Marjorie Ma, right? But now he do. 